Hello and welcome to your weekly tarot card reading for the 4th of August through to the 10th of August. Okay, I thought today we would use the Renaissance Tarot deck. So it's this one here. Okay, and as usual, pick one card for each day of the week from the 4th, Monday the 4th of August through to Sunday the 10th of August. So I'll just shuffle the cards. Okay, so let's see which card we get for Monday the 4th of August. Okay, we have the Six of Swords. And the Six of Swords represents passage away from troubles. And so this means if you've been feeling any difficulty, any um, annoyance, any uh, hardship at the moment, that will be moving away. It will be being washed away so you feel better that those troubles are going to be washed away very soon. Okay, so the card for Tuesday. Tuesday's card is the Eight of Swords. And this means at the moment you are feeling unburdened, you are feeling alone, you are feeling like the world is closing in on you and you're trapped in, in a dead-end relationship, in a dead-end job, in sort of something that's not serving you. And once you let that go, as, as the passage away from troubles you, from um, Monday's card said, those troubles will go away. They will wash away. So that's really good. So it, it tells me that you are letting go. Well done. And so let those go and then you can have, you know, everything you want. Okay, so the next card for Wednesday is Wheel of Fortune. And this basically means Wheel of Fortune, whatever you put out, you'll get back. It's like the karmic wheel. So if you've put good things out into the world, you will start to get good things coming back this week, especially Wednesday, watch out for those good things. And if you've chosen for yourself to put negative things out in the world, well, then perhaps some negative things come back to you. But I believe that, you know, you're all lovely, you're all wonderful people that, that watch this and you've put those wonderful loving lights out into the world which is fantastic so yay and those wonderful loving things will come back to you okay let's go for thursday's card thursday's card is the sun sun which is a fantastic card excellent the sun is all about you know shining bright and having abundance and abundance coming to you and having the sun shining on you and your life filled with love and warmth and joy and, and wonderful things in your world so that's Thursday's card another fantastic card yay okay let's go for Friday's card okay Friday's card is the magician and the magician is all about um, being organized and and being skilled and you know on Friday it's really about your career and moving forward and moving into a new magical era um, a magical time in your career it's really going to move forward okay but you have to this is not about idyllic moving forward this is about you know being realistic and moving forward but knowing that a magical time is coming so you can put those real plans into place and then that will create the magic of your life Okay, let's look at Saturday's card for the weekend. Okay, on Saturday I've got the Page and the Princess of Pentacles. Now this means a message is going to come to you on Saturday. And the message will be a mess, positive message, but in the area of your finances, your money, or in the area of practical help. So on Saturday you'll get some practical or financial help. Okay, now let's look at Sunday's card. What do we have for Sunday? Okay, we have the King of Pentacles card. Now, that's interesting because on Saturday we had the message about, you know, you get a message that financial help is coming or practical help is coming. Well, maybe this is the person that brings it because the King of Pentacles represents a, a wealthy man who, or a man that's very good at practical things that will help you out in that way. So maybe you get the phone call on Saturday 
and maybe he comes on Sunday to help you out. Well, I hope you have a lovely week. Um, and just to let anybody know, I will be doing a um, crystal healing, distance crystal healing today. So if you would like to be um, mentioned or thought of while I'm doing the healing and me to send you that distance crystal healing, just go onto my Facebook page, Colleen Cares. So just type Colleen Cares and you'll find it on Facebook and just like the post that talks about the healing or just um, or just write who you want the healing for underneath that post and I'll include them. So just go to Colleen Cares and if you want um, any services, anything from me, then um, go to www.colleencares.com and you can check me out there. I also have written two books and if you want to know about those two books, you can go to my author's page which is Colleen Christensen um, Author. Okay, on Facebook and I'm also on Twitter if you want to add Colleen Cares um, one. So you've got to put the one, number one after the Colin Cares on Twitter. Okay, well I hope you have a lovely week and I will talk to you soon. Bye now.